All right, guys, this is 2D from Gorillas live and on air. Also, on a chair. It's a beanbag chair, if you're wondering. It's really comfy. I found it in a skip down the road. It was a. What? Stop talking about my chair. Oh. But I was planning to talk about my chair for a bit longer. Um, okay, alright. Well, let's have a song then. Welcome to Song Machine Radio with Gorillas on Apple Music One. It's a bit of a mouthful there, isn't it? I'm 2D, lead singer of Gorillas, coming at you from Kong Studios in West London from the inside of the store cupboard next to the downstairs toilet because the studio's busy. It's quite dark in here actually, but I've got my phone torch, so it's all right. Anyway, I'm your DJ for the first of four Song Machine Radio specials. After me, you'll get three more brilliant shows done by my Gorillaz bandmates, Noodle, Russell and Murdoch. On today's show, I'll be playing loads of banging tunes, some by Gorillaz and some by friends that we've recorded with. Also, I'll be cranking up the chat machine and talking to a really special guest and Gorillaz calibrator, Georgia. But before that, here's a track by another Gorillaz calibrator, Robert Smith from The Cure, who we recently went to the moon with. That was 10.15 Saturday night by The Cure. Normally I'm in bed by 10.15, unlike Robert Smith, who stays up all night and turns into an owl or something, apparently. Okay, now for a song by someone you'll most definitely remember from our track Stylo, that one with the car chase and Bruce Willis. It's Yasin Bey, and he's got L-O-V-E, which spells, um, love. <laughs> You're listening to Song Machine Radio with Gorillaz on Apple Music One. You're listening to Song Machine Radio with Gorillaz on Apple Music One, and I'm your host, 2D. I've already said that, but you've got to repeat stuff on radio or everyone forgets what they're listening to. Mm. Big shout out to Jonah's policewoman for that last track, The Magic. Also, can I do a shout out to Russell, Noodle or Murdoch from Gorillaz? If you're listening guys, um, can someone bring me a cup of tea please? Because my mouth is well dry. This is Song Machine Radio with Gorillaz on Apple Music One. Okay, up next is a gorilla song I really enjoyed making because in the video I sing, I dance and I wear some well high jeans and I play the harpsichord which is a bit like an old fashioned piano from the Game of Thrones times. The track is called Sleeping Powder. Hello again, it's getting exciting now because it's almost time to fire up the chat machine and speak to my special guest, Georgia, who played on Aries, the song, not the star sign. But before that, I want to play a tune from another one of Gorilla's friends, that man, Beck. I love Beck. He's written so many wicked and brilliant songs. I'm a loser, baby, so why don't you kill me? It's one of the greatest songs ever, although it's quite a bad chat up line. Welcome back to Song Machine Radio with Gorillas on Apple Music One. That last track was People by Us, as in um, Gorillas, not a band called Us, if you know what I mean. Right, in a few minutes I'll be switching on the chat machine and giving Georgia a bell. I hope she's about, um, you know, maybe I should text her just to check. Yeah, I better do that. Um, okay, right, while I do that, here's one of her tunes. It's called About Work the Dance Floor. This is Song Machine Radio with Gorillas. Oh, what a tune. And now we can talk to the artist herself because it's time to turn on the chat machine. Machine, 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 machine. <laughs> Right, is it on? I think it's on. Looks like it's on. Right, okay. 
Yeah, so today we're chatting to an incredible producer, singer, songwriter and drummer. She's like a musical octopus, but she actually lives on the land. Apple Music One. Song Machine Radio with Gorillaz. Georgia, are you all right? Welcome to the show. How's it going today? It's all right, thanks. How did you find your um, visit to Kong Studios then? Did you enjoy working with us lot? Oh, I loved it. You know I did. It's always been a dream of mine to work with you lot. You've been um, one of my biggest inspirations since I was a little girl. So to be in the studio with you all was just such a pleasure. And um, it was such a thrill when I heard Aries. I thought it was one of the best tracks that I think Gorillaz have ever done. So it was just such a joy to be able to play with you all. Yeah, so thank you, 2D. Uh, I thank you. We, we're big fans of yours here as well, so we were just really chuffed that you wanted to come and hang out with us and, and play some tunes with us. It was nice to nice to spend a bit of time with you. Uh, okay, let's, let's just see what the first question from the chat machine is. Nice one. Chat machine asks, why does the world need music? Wow, that's a that's a big, deep question, isn't it? It is a deep one, isn't it? <laughs> that's a deep one. Um, I, I think that music provides an escapism for people, like more so than any other art form, really. I definitely feel like when I first watched or, or heard of a gorilla's show, it was like taking me to this other world, and that provided a real sense of inspiration to me and just to, like, get into the imagination of other people's minds is a great is a great escapist thing and i think without that the world would be a, a very repressed and dark place yeah i totally agree with you can't even imagine what it'd be like if we didn't have any music or anything just be like most saddest thing ever wouldn't it we wouldn't have a job 2d what would we be doing i don't know well i'm retraining as a plumber anyway you don't know about you <laughs> um Let's um, have a look at the next question then. Um, right, so if you were like God for a day and you could wow. change one thing, what would you change? And oh, no, another easy question. <laughs> yeah, another easy question from the chat machine. Yeah, thanks, chat machine. <laughs> Do you know what? I've always, I've always thought it'd be amazing if we could all swim under, like hold our breath underwater like if we all had gills yeah also i watched that recent um documentary i don't know if you saw it 2d it was a it was on um it was about an octopus and a man bonding in this yeah. um part of the ocean in in south africa and i thought wow you know like no one not every day do people get to experience that it's a very few people but what if everyone could experience that like the, I reckon the world would be a bit different. They're, they're very clever animals, aren't they? They're very clever. Very clever indeed. All right, last question, chat machine. What is your least favourite kind of tree? Oh, wow. My least favourite kind of tree. I don't think I can answer that, 2D, because, like, trees are the best thing ever even like the trees where you you know like when you're driving through the country or something like countryside or like whatever and you see a dead tree and it even looks dark and black and like like Silhouette. it's been electric yeah i even like that sort of tree so a thunderstruck tree yeah thunderstruck tree that's um that i make a wicked band name thunderstruck, thunderstruck tree. tree you can have that yeah. one I'll have that one too, we'll, yeah. we'll do another collaboration on that one if you want. Thunderstruck <laughs> tree. Thunderstruck uh, tree. Sounds good to me. Do you ever hug trees, 2D? Um, yeah, I've been known to, to hug trees. And um, yeah. I, I thought one tree um, at the end of the garden um, contained yeah. uh, an entire universe once. Um, wow. But I was, I was wrong. My neighbour pointed out it was just a, yeah. just a tree. This is Song Machine Radio with Gorillas on Apple Music One. Okay. Um, well, listen, it's been absolutely brilliant having you on the chat machine. Oh, thanks, 2D. It's been so good as well. And like, hopefully next year we'll be able to play a few shows together, eh? Fingers crossed. Anyway, let's have a listen to you and Gorillas together in. You're tuned in to Song Machine Radio with Gorillas on Apple Music One, hosted by me, 2D at Kong Studios in London. 
latest news here is that I'm still waiting for that cup of tea. Anybody? That last song was Breezing by George Benson, the guitar legend who played on our track, Humility. He is the man. He even appeared on stage with us at Demon Days LA. You know, that music festival we did when you used to be able to do them things and they were still legal. Right, anyway, um, from one legend to another now, Elton John, one of the crown jewels of British music and a lovely bloke. He recently performed on our track, The Pink Phantom, along with The Incredible Black. Let's have a little listen. Welcome back to the show, beaming out across the universe from Kong Studios in London. Wherever you are, I hope you're all right and having a good time. Um, I'm in the cupboard. Uh, the light from my phone torch has attracted this massive moth. It's the size of a dinner plate and it's flapping about everywhere. But, um, yeah, the show must go on. <laughs> The good news is Murdoch just brought me a nice cup of tea. Mmm, thank you. <sighs> that is really smooth. Talking of smooth, I want to play a track by the late great artist and close friend of Gorillaz. He wasn't with us long enough, although he was with us quite a long time. I'm talking about the most magical man who ever crossed the street. Bobby Womack. What a guy. And here he is with an absolute classic. Cheers for everything, Bobby. OK, well, I'm sorry to say that this is the end of Song Machine Radio Part 1. Well, not quite the end, because I'm still talking, but nearly. So from me and this big massive moth on my head, thanks for coming on this musical journey with us, wherever you are on the planet. Don't worry, though, because my bandmates Noodle, Russell and Murdoch are going to take over the mic for three more brilliant episodes of Song Machine Radio with Gorillaz. Coming soon. Until then, here's one more of our friends to play us out. She's a singer, producer, actress, fashion icon and hula hooper. We did a song together on our album, Humans, called Charger. And in a studio, she was doing handstands with Noodle. I also had the honour of being her personal coat stand. <laughs> this is the one and only Grace Jones with Sinning. I was too deep. See you later. <laughs>